What should we play? What's something fun to play in PvZ? Archon drop. Actually, Archon drop with DTs could be. Yeah, let's do that. Let's let's play DT drop. With uh, even double war prism. This is something I did in in the past. This map is also, I think, decent for it. Let's give it a try. Double war prism DT drop. This is what it is, guys. It's gonna be an amazing situation. I I, I promise you. This is the the build that you want to do when you want to style on your opponent and still lose the game. So that's perfect for today's uh, today's games. Okay, how, how do we do that? I don't remember if, uh, how do I do the DT drop. Oh, he's not making an expansion here. That's a little bit more awkward then. DT drop is great versus this pa expansion pattern, but much worse versus this expansion pattern, I think. Uh, let's let's give it a try anyway. I'm gonna play a little bit of a greedy opening though, uh, 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 which is like I'll probably go like only two gateway units, maybe even one. Like, I can play extremely greedy here on this map. Don't try this at home, kids. I I will probably play even one gateway unit only. But he will see that one gateway. Maybe I can start with a stalker, is it possible? I forgot how to do that build. Precisely, but like we'll still make it work. Because if I start with a stalker first, I can shoot away the overlord, which is nice. We'll not get to see uh, the Twilight Council or Robo. Oh, he's already researching. I think this is going to be a... Uh, I think it's gonna be a link flood, guys. <laughs> I, I think uh, this might not be the the game to play the double war prison archon drop. I'll still give it a try, but uh, the alarm bells are already there. Do not try this. Let's still send the probe. I saw the adapt forward. Yeah, there's the links coming. I think, I think I'll even show him the DT Shrine, I don't care. I, mean, I don't have to show it to him. Oh, it's not gonna survive, is it? There's no way it survives. Why are these links still here? I think I need to stop pro production now and start the four gateways. And the warp is them, I think it's something like that. Looking good. He didn't get to see the dark shrine, but of course he can suspect that it's there because I'm not playing the standard glaives build. And if, if you're not playing glaives with Twilight Council, what do you do? Well, obviously, charge that all in. <laughs> not. Okay, we need another pylon. This is so old school. I think another pylon as well. Actually, it would be nice to get into his main base. Morgis are about to finish. The timing is working out perfectly. Look at this. Look at that warp in 500, 500 at the moment of Dark Train finishing. All gateways. I'm on the other side of the map with the warpism. Actually, perfect. Man, I'm a build order god. So he knows this is exactly this. I will not even try to make DT, uh, the DTs work. Like I'm not expecting to do any damage with the DTs, we'll just do it with the Archons. Okay, now we go the Warp to the other side. He has roaches, but it's fine. Oh, that's ambitious. By me. Now oh, we can make a nexus actually. I just realized that. Yes, queen's here though. Base is 
under attack. Your Not lose this arcing though. Okay, that's good. Now we're making charge and model. Okay, this is good. Fourth base already. Okay, it doesn't care. It doesn't care what's happening in the game if he just follows a build order. Hello, Queens. One, get in, please. Thank you. Let's clear some creep. Can you make the third, fourth base here? I think he is, right? Oh. Okay, it's cancelled. No. That's safe on the sentry, man. Actual godlike. Man, that is such a cool build. It worked so perfectly! <laughs> oh my god, that was so good! <laughs> the multitasking was just out of this world. <laughs> and the double Warpism Archon is, is your biggest friend versus Xerx. I, it worked brilliantly right there. It was super cost efficient. It was quite fun to play with, to be honest. And we have a bark of Zerg now. <laughs> Shall we try it again, guys? Should we do it again? Okay, let's let's go. Let's do the DT drop. <laughs> the the magical build order of today's uh, today's games. I mean, it worked so well in the previous game, so why not give it a second try, huh? Okay, I mean this map is a little bit different though. I cannot make a wall off with only one gateway, and that slows down the build a little bit because I need to have a wall off. I can also just. Toss the coin and hope that this guy is not going to be all enemy and don't wall off. But that doesn't make the build any better. But we love risk, so might as well give it a try. Okay, let's play. This guy is going for the uh, hatchery first, that's nice. I think so, at least. I mean, the, this drone could indicate many things, but might as well be the hatchery first. No 12 pulse will be nice. Okay, that's good. Hatchery first confirmed. It's also in a good position for me to harass with the warpism, as for the previous game. Now we're going to use the chronobus on the nexus to get the additional gases as much as possible. Gonna make a gas now? Nope. He's not making the gas. Okay, so at least if he, if he wants to go for any kind of aggression, at least it's going to be slowed down a little bit by the gas timing of his. Let's try to make a nexus now. I don't want to lose the probe though. I should not be moving around with a wounded probe like that. Let's just focus on the micro point now. Skip that 
Cybernetic Spore. Actually, what worked in my favor in the previous game is that I sniped the Overlord of my opponent while doing this build, so that did slow down him a little bit. I guess he got the information in exchange, I'm not sure what's, what's more important. Okay, there's a full finishing. Looks like no links are in production for now. This oh, I have 4 pros in the gas. That's a mistake. Let's not do that. But actually start with a stalker first. It's not very common. But it worked in the previous game. Might as well do it here. Wait, did I go stalker first or did I go adept first? I don't even remember. I think it was adept first. Let's go. Gonna need a robot soon, but we need to wait for money. It is kind of greedy what I'm doing, like I said, but that's the point of the build. <laughs> it's just greedy. Okay, that's the robo. I can kind of scout with the adept as well. Go around. Maybe see something. The stalker is going to defend me for the time being. Glory to the day law. Oh my god, the D shrine. And I need the additional gateways now. Actually, wait, I made them after the... After the gases. Oh, he's gonna see the Dark Shrine. It's a bit awkward. No, 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 I cannot lose this Adept. Please don't lose this Adept. Please! Let it live! Oh, I didn't. I'm gonna need at these gateways now. It's a bit more... Chaotic this time. I can make the warp prison now. I need additional probes and lots of pylons now. Yeah, I think that the Dark Shrine is a little bit too early. I'm like 20 seconds of the Dark Shrine now. Uh, completing. It's gonna finish before I can do anything about it. So. Kinda hasty there. Oh, wait, what? He could have at least attacked the Stalker here. Interesting. He chose not to. I appreciate that. Let's move in with this. Yeah, you can see Dark Shrine is finishing and I'm, I don't have my gateways finished. So I kind of rushed it. Too early. Okay. Uh, well, he's gonna see this. So. A bit awkward. Tries to intercept me. Well, he kind of does. Huh. Is this working? That worked fantastically, you know? Why do I have probes here all of a sudden? Only one thing here. Okay, harassment. I don't want to lose the prison, right? He has roaches this time. This guy knows what he... Oh, ah, I made the Arkham, but I didn't bring them. Look here. I hope there's no queens there. Okay, charge. Forge. It's actually such a multitask heavy. Build. Oh, well, he's here, but he cannot defend this. He doesn't know it's two prisms. He cannot go to the main base with the queens at the same time, I think. No way, right? Hello? Kill this four. He wasn't expecting four Archons here, for sure. And that's fine. He does have a spore here. Might as well open some DTs, huh? Okay. 
I don't want to lose the prism here. I didn't clear his proof but either. A bit awkward. I never started plus one. It could have been done a, a little bit better. But it's still good enough, I think. He's gonna attack me with like mass roaches, I think. I kinda want to make more archons as well. Here. I lose the world server here. I forgot he has observer, uh, overseer. Can I go here? Oh, it's a bit awkward. The overseer, maybe? Not quite possible. Can maybe kill this four. He's consistently making more roaches. I don't like this. Looks like we are going to be under attack, ladies and gentlemen. And probably v very shortly. Maybe even. What right about now? I mean, I'll make a fourth. I don't think he has a fourth. I'll make a uh, Robo Bay for Disruptors. Doesn't look like he has fourth. Oh, there it is. No? Oh, these roaches are in trouble, guys. Oh no! My friend! Get him! <laughs> he just attacked me like his entire arsenal of roaches. Oh, he comes back. What? That is an interesting setup. Events. I, I can lose some probes, that's okay. He will never recover from this damage anyway. Look at the, the amount of units I have here. Absolutely no chance for him. <laughs> the double Archon drop, guys. It strikes again. It's the build. I figured PvZ. The Jack Blink. The impressive micro. The F2. Let's go F2. Okay. Like he really needs to give up now. He wants to get the Warpers in, but I have a second one here, my friend. GG! <laughs> the double arc on drop, guys. It works. Look at the cost efficiency. It's actually perfect. It's the best build on the market right now, guys. Actually best build.